about modern day Cruella DeVille, you cannot tell me that this unit, like this is not giving what it's supposed to give. Like it's just drop dead gorgeous. Do it like that and then it pretty much holds that style in place. You see that? Locked and loaded.
right guys so we are back with another hair video so this unit today is actually very cute very stylish and very on trend now you guys know that whole skunk stripe type type of look has been going on a lot of the times you'll see it with different colors but this time around they kind of went for the Cruella DeVille type of style just kind of like lightly presented in you know modern day 2023 so this looks very good guys and it's kind of like a, a 613 blonde right here very very nice rich platinum blonde and it's only right in the front area right here on the side I like the fact that when they actually parted this unit guys they left like a little bit of the blonde hair on this side I was actually gonna go ahead and split and put everything on one side but when I saw it like this I was like you know what that's really really cute so let me go ahead and leave it like this now this unit guys is a 13 by 4 HD frontal lace frontal wig guys this unit is 22 inches long and is 180% density. Now with this unit, it came already pre-styled in like a body wave texture. They put some curls in it. So I didn't have to do much with this unit. I just added my own curls on top. Now with this unit, obviously you guys saw me cut some layers into it. I really felt like the layers definitely elevated the style up, especially with the skunk striped area in the front right here. Adding this layer on right here definitely kind of emphasized it more and gives the hair more of a formation and more of a bounce now I did go ahead and cut this side as well too guys to give you guys like a little bit of a feather bang effect effect right here and I cut layers all the way down I did it on both sides very very simple method guys I'm not a cutter I don't know how to cut hair that well but I kind of know how to frame my face just because I've been doing this for a while so I knew I was gonna aim to get it a certain type of way and this is basically the way I like to cut my hair when I'm doing layers on a side part and middle part as well so it came out pretty good guys the volume on this hair is a great volume, 180% density is very nice. Now the unit is kind of like I said, the 613 right here, but I feel like the base color is like almost like a jet black color. It's closer to a 1, it's not a 1B, it's definitely dark, but I feel like the contrast together just makes the hair look super striking, guys. Now the HD frontal part is very, very clean. I'm not going to lie to you guys, you don't have to bleach this unit, you don't have to tweeze this unit, you don't have to do anything to it. I literally just put the unit on. It was the same day install as you guys can see. So I installed this thing on camera today, straight out the box. Very, very simple. So this is definitely a unit that you could just do a same day install with. If you have an event to go to and you got to quickly go, it's an easy glue down type of situation. I would not recommend this one as a glueless type of unit. It does come with an adjustable strap, but I felt like if you want to get like a really, really nice beat down type of look with this unit, it definitely will look, work better with kind of gluing it down. I did go ahead and use my Even Wonder Lace um, adhesive on this one and I added a few layers. I feel like it did a pretty good job. I did go ahead and seal it off with the Even Wonder Lace Supreme as well to the spray just to make sure that everything stays secure and flat. I didn't do baby hairs on this unit guys just because there's no point of doing baby hairs. The curls and the color is the show of this. Baby hairs has just been too distracting on this unit so I try to go in for more of a clean effect, a clean look. I absolutely love this guys. Very, look at that. Can you talk about modern day Cruella DeVille? You cannot tell me that this unit, like this is not giving what it's supposed to give. Like it just drop dead gorgeous. Like I absolutely love this. I've never ever done a color like this or just like a piece of color like this. And I'm not going to lie to you guys. I kind of feel like this is kind of going into my style. I feel like this looks like, girl, you stepping out with this bad boy. I really, really like it. If you guys don't want to put layers in it, you don't have to put layers in it. But I feel like if you're going to wear it in a curled formation style, I think layers will look really nice. You can go ahead and wear this straight, but in my opinion, this looks better in a curl set. Even if you add some flexi rods to this one and just buff it out, ooh, it's giving vibes, guys. So you guys probably will see this unit on me a lot. I feel like this is something I'm definitely going to have to pop out with next month. I have a couple of events to go to, a couple of parties. I just feel like this is a showstopper type of unit. You walk in, it looks like a plain black unit from the back, but just coming straight in, it's just giving such a light bad B type of vibe guys very very pretty I feel like the lace is super impeccable as well guys didn't have to do that much to it I feel like it just comes off looking super natural and super pretty love it guys and like I said light layers and as an overall spray for the unit for the curls guys especially the curls that I redid in the front I just use my even wonder lace and I just kind of curl it um it holds a pretty good style you guys can see once I hold it like this let's let me show you guys do it like that and then it pretty much holds that style in place. You'll see that? Locked and loaded. 
So I definitely feel you need to try this type of color mix at least once in your lifetime. This is my first time trying this, and I'm not going to lie to you guys. It's probably one of my favorite kind of mixes. It's not doing too much. It's a base color with a little bit of a pop, and the pop just pop, 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 pops, guys. So let me know what you guys think about this unit, guys. This install today was very, very easy. It's kind of going back to my glue style unit, so hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. I will leave all the information down below, guys, including a coupon code if you want to go ahead and purchase this unit from West Kiss Hair. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I will catch you guys in a later one.